I got a job at Tower Records because that's the only place that I could get a job with my f***ing haircut. That is the truth. <laughs> the largest record store in the universe is Tower Records. Tower Records had everything. They were like friends. If you came into town, you went to Tower Records. Tower was the center of it all. San Francisco. New York. Japan. London. Revenues of a billion dollars. The whole thing became a phenomenon. Tower was like the place to work at. We had no dress code. There was always a party atmosphere. And even if you threw up, you had to show up. You were part of his family. That was the fun part. Russ Solomon, Tower Records was what he did. I don't think he thought he could do any wrong. A perfect storm of events was developing. There was no need for kids to even go in a record store to get their music. When the banks came in, we knew that things were going to change. It's the end of an icon. He fought, but he basically had to cut the heart out of the company. Somebody's taken it away from us. The bank said, we don't need a visionary. It defined the generation. It was really the statement of that time. To be able to go into a store where there was people that knew music, it's just a missing part of our society now. I don't really understand why it's gone. We just happened to be at that right place at the right time. You want to call that luck? We call it luck. What would you call it? Luck. 